Yo, what up, guys? It's the Don PC with you back with another video, and today we'll be doing a gameplay and review on the son of George, literal baby Haji. So I have my reasons for picking him, which I will explain in this video. But if you want to choose someone else, here's the reason why I did not pick them. The reason I didn't choose this dude is because his links are freaking difficult, and he has a very shit card. And for all you see, this man is an absolutely sick card, and I would have picked him. But I have my reasons, and I will explain them very shortly. This man is a really good card, and if you want to choose him, choose him. But the reason I did not choose him is because I already have an amazing left mid slash left wing from the Scottish Premiership, and that is Ryan Kent. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Speaking of Ryan Kent, here's one of the reasons why I chose freaking Haji. It's because he himself gets a strong link. Good luck, motherfuckers. You're in trouble now. <laughs> Clear my throat. Uh, let's get to the gameplay. It's gameplay time. Okay, it's taking quite some time to get a goal in this game, but finally we managed to pull one off here with a beautiful drag back and a first time shot there, and it's gone in. That shocked me. That actually shocked me. There we go. There's the two Rangers boys and Fred. So that was actually a pretty decent goal for a guy with 83 finishing. If you think about it, look at this. I basically just dragged back and I just took the shot, and it somehow just went in. Not bad for a guy who has 83 finishing, I think. Not bad. And we're nearing the end of the game, and we finally get another goal with Haji here. I mean, the guy's speed is amazing, and balance, surprisingly, for 80 balance, is pretty good. The dribbling is not even bad. The dribbling is amazing. The balance doesn't really affect it that much. It's actually, he's actually really good. I'm actually enjoying this card. Like, he's very good, and as you can see, this guy is about to quit, and we may have to go into another game because there's very little highlights. It's basically two goals. So... I mean, let's just get into the next game, guys. Let's go. Is this guy gonna quit? Are you gonna quit? There we go. Let's get to the next game. And here we go with the second game, and here we go with Haji again. The man is so slick. I mean, the dribbling, the speed, it all just goes well together. I tried a long shot here to see what happened, and, well, the goalkeeper saved it. Now, this is one of my favorite moments while using the card. This was amazing. I'm basically walking through this guy's defense, and I scored. This card feels so slick. I mean, the guy has 80 balance on his card. He has 80 balance, but he, he feels so good. I don't know why. He just feels... Maybe it's the ball control. Maybe the ball control is really good. I mean, this guy is really amazing. You should choose him. But for those of you who do not have Kent, I suggest pick, uh, picking Alan Lucy because he is like a good alternative for Ryan Kent. And we're through once again. But I do not want to score with Dan James. I want to score with Haji. And the man bangs it top burns. Ha. <laughs> This card is way too fun. Honestly, this card is really, really fun. I'm really enjoying Okay, well then, I guess the gameplay's over. Okay guys, it's time for the final summary on Baby Haji. Pros are in green and cons are in red. Well, usually cons are in red. This man has none. Now, I would say Lynx would be one of his cons, but that's unfair to him. Like, no one's really gonna be putting him into their team. Maybe some people will put him with Kent like I just did. But otherwise, you're gonna bring him on as a super sub. Now, let's get to his pros. Speed, dribbling, shooting. It's self-explanatory. Shooting, I'm surprised with. 83, 83 finishing. And you saw the goals he was freaking putting in for me. And that's on a basic chem style. I didn't put anything on him. That was on a basic chem style. Five-star skill moves really helps. Passing is amazing. Physical. Physical. I looked at this guy and I was like, there's no way he's going to push these defenders off. He's freaking pushing defenders and CDMs off the ball. I was actually surprised at that. He's actually pretty strong. Now the positions you can play him in, left mid, center mid, and center forward. He's actually pretty decent to play anywhere almost. And, well, except defender, don't blame there, come on, 45 defender, you can see that yourself. Now, I do suggest putting an engine cam style on him, because maybe you want to increase his balance, maybe. So, yeah, therefore I've given him a 10 out of 10, he's actually a really good card, so if you want to get him, get him, otherwise get Alianusi, just don't pick the other guy. So, thank you for watching, don't forget to like, subscribe, and do everything else, and I'll see you in the next one. Good, bye.